Weeks. Five seconds. Jug and Terrorblade, I think, are two two heroes out there. Slark, if they oh. want to go. Oh, wow. Oh. Like Life Slayer has seven CS. KP actually, interestingly, opts for the Burrow Strike. They're, so they're looking to be aggressive and setting up kills, rather playing passive and, and you know, looking to run Life Slayer out of the lane. In fact, Girl Strike going oh, up on the lane. top lane. DP in trouble. <laughs> Simultaneous deaths. Silent kills off SC. SC kills off G. A little bit of an interesting play there. You know, we were talking about this right before the game started. Uh, this is like an S. Oh, Afterlife now begins to take a page out of uh, U9's playbook. Not only cuts a wave on the bottom, but might be going down here. Impale will hit Afterlife in the jungle, trying to farm the camp. Moogie will take a kill. Easy, easy kill there with that rotation. It opens up other things now as well, as Silent is going to get ran at by SC and Faith. They do have the Tombstone available, two levels up in it, but don't want to drop it now just in case things go awry. And, well, Faith actually in some trouble. He is going to drop the Tombstone now, gets the double, the chaos. That's going to keep Faith alive, and they are going to be able to turn this. Bring down Silent, possibly, yes. He is going to die. Omega trying to back out. We'll see if they can actually make the escape. No mana right now for the Impale from the Nyx Assassin. And that keeps those other two here. Axes in the area as well, and Afterlife wants to take this stack okay. really badly. There's a the start started off. The call, he pulls him back in before the Burrow Strike and trying to find that kill. Now, can they get it? The real you there as well, and they will pick it up. Yep. No level six on Afterlife. Just armor as well. He's going to take a lot of damage from it. Uh, Ice Tower is coming back in as uh, well. Hey, yo. <laughs> <laughs> that is a scary moment indeed. Uh, I don't know. They're here. moving in. Oh my god, they actually just killed off Sioma. Now they're taking out another. KP finds the kill into Afterlife. Epicenter coming out as well. Can they bring down the real you? Rage turning to fight. Needs to run away now because Kaka is here. He's slowed down as well. Can they get that kill? And Pale is there. Newbie, get it. They find. Oh my god, that was such a huge collection of kills. Silent rotating in. He's got the Nightmare Torrent combo, but I don't think they have enough damage to get the kill here. Kaka trying to impale, but great life. Oh, here comes uh, Mugi, the fun police. Says everyone back off. KP will get X. That's a level 2X. Can they set up the Torrent on top? No, LSA is just as good, though. And KP should be able to go down. Yeah, and they don't really want to commit too much right there. If you do SC, if they get this, this would be such a huge pickup, but. Now SC playing it safe, there's going to be the taunt, they're going to be able to find this now, Light Trick Ray as well, Laguna Boy to come and the dunk. SC goes down. Could get to the fight very quickly. Um, you know, Invoker is really the, the best friend of the Nyx attack. Oh, Blink. There we go, good call though, and SC is there as well, wants to try and turn this one back around, but they're already dead on Kaka. The boat comes out as well, Fiend Strip is there, they're trying to bring him down, and well, Sand King under a little bit of duress, can they kill him off? Oh, KP, barely left alive, but the Life Stealer will run him down. They have the X onto Faith as well, Real you trying to run away, Exorcism has been popped as well, Silent taking some damage, Afterlife thinking about going back to the fight, we'll find that call, it's Pretty bold, but can they do enough damage? They will be able to run down. No, they can't kill off SC either. So, newbie win in a big way there. They bought back on Silent. Uh, can they actually take this fight though? They're gonna have to run inside of Silent. A huge problem coming out for Vega Squadron. They actually jumped inside of that creep and the real you also under fire now. Faith trying to run him down. Can they get the damage out to kill off this life stealer? Sioma is there as well. X marks the spot, trying to pull him back. They're gonna be at the shrine. Newbie just running right now at Vega Squadron. Epicenter being channeled up, no blink dagger just yet. KP missing it completely, air balls. Afterlife is back alive and he is looking to, well, reinforce his, al his ally. And, well, a sea of space has been created by the undying SE. Fest still 60 seconds till cooldown. Blink caught. Okay, dragging him back a little bit, but the TPs are coming in. KP blinking forward. Burrow Strike on Afterlife. They got the chain stun, they got the technology, and that should be a kill. That was so well played by Newbie. I mean, we their jungle, and they just end up being able to turn it around completely. They smoke right afterwards, and I don't think G is expecting this. Here comes Kaka, blinking forward. Two men Burrow Strike. Oh, Two men in hell as well. Combo combo's good. And the spike, the spike onto the Lina. G is on the run. Looks like he should be fine thanks to the haste that he's got activated, but the rest of the team, uh-oh. 
What a blink stun. They got the boat, though. It's going to connect on a three. No way to save that Kunkka. Torrent to follow, but guess what? Newbie is showing right now in Afterlife. Their best gank okay. is going to start to come. They want to move Kaka. in for this. They're going to break it on the Kaka. And, well, already down. They can't go for this fight. Now, Newbie, they want to take the fight instead. Torrent boat, it's going to come out. Can they jump down and kill off Mugi? A little bit too scary, but now they've caught the axe. The Old Scepter lift up. They're in a little bit of trouble trying to bring down Etsy. The Intrip is there as well. They try and bring him down, but they just don't have enough damage. This isn't going to work at all for Vega Squadron. The Torrent lift up Burrow and gone. They're going to move forward. Silent being gone on, but the call is going to be there. The dunk party. Show me those hoops. No, there's no dunks whatsoever. In fact, he's going to get stunked right now. Kaka on the run. Looks like they will take down Kaka as well. Sioma on the back line. Pretty good torrents, all things considered. But here comes Lina. Blinking for is KP. The two-man burrow strike still on cooldown. Where are these axe dunks? He's constantly being silenced. He will get one on Mugi. No, looks like the KS is going to be there. I believe Newbie perhaps has overstayed the welcome. No, G is going to go down. The call is going to be there. KP being healed up. The Sandstorm, they are out of reveal at this point. Now they're moving on to Faith. Afterlife will have to blink stun in one second. This should be pretty good now. And they're going to at least be able to clean up this Undyne. It's another nice pickup. Newbie end up falling behind in that fight in spite of separate axe calls that were going in there. Um, really well done. Oh, Epi, he's going back in. They want to take it. The absolute madman. They oh. are going to go find a kill. Oh, the real you, Aloha. He turns it back around. and got Kaka in some trouble. They pull back in KP oh. as well. The boat is going to be there. Can it connect? No, but they do still have the light strike array and find the kill. Newbie crumbling in this one. Farming out their side of the jungle right now that's sort of been dictated by the way that the map movements have come. Afterlife jumps forward, able to find the Sand King, and KP okay. in a little bit of trouble. They find that kill. Good day, sir. Nina? That is he's Gonna get a little jump away. Can Silent actually make his escape? There's static link up. They could be thinking right now, Vega Squadron of turning to see if they can fight this. But Silent, dead too quick. In the haste room from Kung Game for the Axe. <laughs> but, um... Oh, oh, Kaka scouts out Afterlife, but right into what? Century War he oh, goes. Oh, nicely done, and that's going to be an easy pickup. Yep, and immediately a whole lot of Aloha density. It seems like that is what Vega's prepping for right now. Now Sioma walking in that area, wants Ooh, to check if Roche is up. Uh, Burrow went towards mid. Lena completely left alone. There's also going to be a jump in Afterlife. He didn't end up catching them all. Barely able to keep that Lena alive. Kunkka throws out the boat. They have the rum onto him, but Aloha Dance in trouble, under fire, and brought down. They lose the axe as well. Newbie striding forward. They've got the Yules up on the Kunkka. This is a problem right now, Vega Squadron. Yes, Yoma's going to get picked off as well. What a bait here. Well, not even Attic Link and Nexus is going, but. You know, like you pointed out, without these abilities, can't do too much. But we're going to see yet another kill attempt here. I hope this one don't turn it against them. Yeah, that Oops. is tough. And a Yule Scepter to boot to just create that separation between them and the Life Stealer. It's just they're not able to accomplish anything that they want to. And honestly, right now, Aloha might be in a little bit of trouble. They're thinking about dying for this one, bro. Strike. Not there. They get a good call, though. Afterlife, the PKB is popped as well. Can they find this kill? It doesn't quite look like it's going to be enough. They got the Spike Care up this up as well to turn that boat back around onto the Kunkka. There is going to be the Shrine going, though, keeping that lean alive, but not long enough. Mookie, too big, too bad, and too strong in this fight. Aloha Dance just gets evaporated. The real you, Aloha Dance, also now in trouble again. They're going to have another the burrow strike in just a couple of seconds and that is going to be three down my goodness gracious newbie hitting hard the the Doreen core is there as well and Vega are just nowhere to be found. They're trying to go for a wraparound play right now. Afterlife is there. The smoke has been popped. Four step forward. Can they get it? They find the call onto that Death Prophet trying to bring it over. They are going to be able to get the kill. A huge one indeed. And the boat comes through as well. Stunned onto two. KP trying to find this kill. Can they do it? It doesn't look like it's going to be enough. Afterlife, he actually walks away. There's the Yule Scepter lift up. It might be able to kill him off as he comes back down. KP now also in trouble. But they're just too strong. Again, it's Mugi. He's too big. They're going to be able to run him down, find the kill, possibly. Gee, they don't even need to. They're just going to turn on to Silent. They're going to turn on to these towers. 
Newbie with their eyes on the prize, trying to find the kills. They get the Carapace stun on Alina as well. There's been some tidying. The DP went down, but at the end of the day, Newbie stand tall. In their base, but that is just a number game at that point, right? Like, we, when that fight happened, Newbie was up at least 10k, maybe 12, 13k. So, great initiation by Vega, but they're just outgunned at this point, you know? Newbie's got shotguns and you got little knives. Yeah. Well, and yeah, I mean, you, you think about be running down mid, popping exorcism, popping eye of the storm. Whoa, well, okay. Oh, oh my God! No. What? They're there! Oh, oh they just no. broke them. They broke everything that they had going left over. They oh, try and kill off the no. sand king. It was never gonna happen. Deny, deny, deny. And KP on a killing spree. Newbie feeling good. They're it's a disaster. Oh god. There's the silence. Life Stealer just gonna have to be forced away. They have the DP ulti as well. Newbie running circles around Vega Squadron right now. Dyer's middle barracks. Dyer's middle barracks. Good idea by the axe. Take the fight out. Stay in the game for the bitter end. You go one last time. Hold on to your pride, CIS. We're with you. Tier 4 tower is going down, but they have another shot at this with Axe back up in 8 seconds. I mean, Mugi now has cheese and BKB active, so <laughs> good luck. We got to create the illusion. Are they going to die fountain? Are they just going to go for this? Do they even care? There's the dust. They got one. Afterlife jumps in. They want to try and run him down. There's a burn strike onto two, though. There is no follow-up for this Axe. The boat comes out. Yeah, it's looking mighty rough right now. G's actually doing some damage to Kaka, but he's getting the heal coming back in from that Undyne. They are fountain farming almost at this point. And no real way to stop this. KP, Epicenter, Burrow doesn't even need to use it. They're just playing around at this point. Let the creeps hit it. We don't hit your Ancients. Leave that to our minions. All right, GG comes out. A newbie survives the elimination day. They will move on joining their Chinese veteran IG tomorrow. Well, it's a...